Hey, what's up, guys? It's Savage here, and this video, we're going over some just two problems in the game right now that I'm having that's really, really annoying. And one of these problems I've never really experienced before, but the other one, I guarantee everyone in their mom, unless you're a massive whale, experiences this problem. And let's just go over the first problem, the new one. So, right now, as you can see, well. I've done all the story content, I've done all the variants, all that stuff. The only thing I haven't done is Abyss, but I don't have Human Torch, so I'm just waiting to like, get him to make it like not stupidly expensive for some path. So, I have basically no hard content right now, and I've never had this issue before. But what is this? I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 revives, and a crap ton of potions and overflow. And a few of them have already expired already. This is stupid. People... Revives are so valuable. Yeah, if you have no hard content to do it, basically, they just are wasted, and it's really annoying just seeing all this stuff go to waste. Especially when a few months ago, when I was like one act four, um, act six, I would have killed for some more revives and just more stuff in the stash. So it does pain me to see all this stuff run away. And I don't know if you guys have played this game long enough, but in the very beginning of the game, um, in your inventory, oh uh, wait, no, in your inventory you had infinite like there wasn't like a 25 cap you could just have like as many as you wanted and i guess they added it to prevent people from overstocking but that doesn't make any sense to me because it just who cares if you overstock that's a game you're supposed to farm up things and then do things with the items that you farmed so to me it makes no sense that we're just like letting all this shit go to waste i mean it's painful for me to see and what do i do do i go to fucking the thing and sell them for gold i mean how much gold do you even get? 200. It's just not even like, worth it. It's just... All these precious items just going to waste. And it's like, at least let me like donate to these, like, these items to other people or something. Because it's just it's straight up going to waste. And it's actually sad. Um, they, should add in, they should add a system where you can just send revives to like alliance members or people in your friends list. Or just something. Because the fact that they're just going to waste is really annoying to me and i feel like they need to add the old system back where you could just have infinite of a certain item like i mean i don't understand why they're so scared of people just farming i mean i guess they're scared of people not spending shit ton of money because they can't farm enough revives to actually not spend money on it which is stupid but yeah that's just the first issue and the second issue we have is a very big issue very very big and if you go to my lines as you can see Donations due by Thursday, battle chips 37,000, loyalty 27,000, gold 333,000, so like a quarter, I mean a third of a mil, and gold in this game is a fucking problem, okay, and unless you're a whale, like someone who buys cavalier crystals like they're fucking candy, dude, okay, you have this problem, see, even back in the day, bro, always had issues with gold but you know what the second the second they added the fucking gifting crystals and the cavalier crystals this man is fine and golden he has not complained since because he's had like 40 50 60 mil i mean it's just like if you're not a massive whale you basically just struggle with gold i mean everyone knows it. there's just no way you don't if you play this game regularly you know that you struggle with gold and the fact that it takes a five star like like three mil plus gold or something to rank to max out Take six dollars or ridiculous amount of gold. Like, let's just look. If I wanted to rank three of my Corvus right now, seven hundred thousand gold, bro. That is ridiculous. And they added incursions, okay? And incursions might give you like, in a in a full month, it might give you like if you do like like if you do like all the um, if you do like all the rooms like room ten, or for six and room ten for this one or whatever, you get like what like seven hundred fifty thousand gold somewhere around there, but. You can only get that like once a month, and that is nothing, bro. That is straight up nothing. It's straight up because I have to rank up champions for new content, okay? Rank up champions so my catalyst don't go to waste. Which, if you want to look, my catalyst, um, fun, very fun. Always have tier two in the overflow, and I don't want them to go to waste. So I try to rank up characters, but guess what? I can't because I have no gold. And if I want to rank up a character, um. I won't have enough gold for my weekly donations. He just said the weekly donations are today, and I literally don't even have enough gold. I could open my battle chips, which I'm probably going to have to do, but... And you might just say, oh, just grind arena. Bro, 
I grind arena. Why do you think I have 8,000 units right now? I mean, as for someone who grinds arena, even I don't have enough gold to, like, like keep my account up, like, and, like, let my account flourish. I think a big fix they need to do, straight up, to fix this gold issue, is just make stuff not expire. There shouldn't be a limit. You shouldn't, you should be able to have as many 212 or whatever as you want, because uh, it's either I'm forced to upgrade characters, which rapes my gold, because five stars and six stars take a lot of gold, or I just let them expire, which is a waste of resources, so in the future I'm screwed. I just don't understand why they, there has to be an expiration for stuff. Like, why can't I hold... They, they recently have uh, upped the limit to, like, what, $16 or something? Yeah, but, dude, you just need to make it, like, there shouldn't even be a limit. You should just be able to have as many as you want. Because that leads to fucking hoarding at the same time. Like, um, I just recently opened my uh, map 6 and map 7 crystals. But I had, like, 200 map 6 and, like, 100 map 7 crystals. You know why? Because I was maxed out on every tier 4 class catalyst. And if I went over, and tier 2 alpha, and if I went overboard, the things go to waste. So, this leads to just hoarding, bro. Like, like we have, um, what is it? Um, 22 tier 4 class catalyst crystals, 37 tier 3. And I, I opened the tier 4, just taking them out of my inventory, because they just I, they just take a space, I'm annoyed. But, you know, a lot of people with endgame accounts, me at 1.2, they'll literally go to their account, they'll have like 4,000, 3,000 of these crystals just sitting around. And it's actually ridiculous. They need to just... And it just lift the expiration thing because it's stupid, bro. It just creates crazy hoarding. It creates a system where you have to use your gold to rank up characters so you don't waste catalysts. Or you either just fucking have to waste the catalyst and not do it. And then you want enough gold for other things like donations and ranking up characters that you actually want to rank up if like new content comes out. It's just the bottleneck for this game is just gold, dude. Gold is... They need to add more gold. And I want you to take a look at this. For the fucking Cavalier, uh, yeah, Cavalier monthly calendar, you get, what, 1,500 plus 1,500, so that's 3,000. I can barely read because of these check marks. 4,500, you get fucking 7,500, um, 10,500, um, what is it, like 13,500. And then you get all these crystals, which give a minimum of 15,000, and you literally only get the minimum ever from these. So that's... Um, 30,000, 45,000, um, 75,000, I think, I don't know, I'm doing the math really quickly, but it's somewhere around, like, 120,000 for the entire month, for, like, the monthly calendar, and, um, listen, around, oh, I don't know what the exact amount is, because I'm too lazy to actually add it all up, but, basically, it's, like, around 120,000 gold for an entire month of being Cavalier for free, okay? Like, that's cool and all, you might be like, oh, dude, that's 120,000 gold for free, bro, that is fucking nothing okay okay if you take um three months combined to this bullshit three months of being cavalier i can pay one week of donations for doing aq it's just like what like why like i don't understand like why is that a thing bro like, they need to do one of a few things a um, or, I mean, or if they do all these, that'd be great. A, buff the shit of these rewards, because these, these are just fucking trash. Like, if you're Cavalier, this is a fucking, like, this is nothing, bro. 1,500? What the fuck am I gonna do with the 1,500? That's retarded. Um, B, make the stash just, um, infinity. Like, you should be able to have infinity of a certain item. I don't understand why they, I, I don't understand why they, like, make you waste shit. It just doesn't make sense. You got, like, all these catalysts, all these revives, boosts going to waste. It hurts, bro. It really hurts. They need to C, um, reduce the cost of AQ. AQ costs like, um, what is it? Like, um, I mean, just too much, bro. I shouldn't have to pay fucking, what is it? A third of a million gold, which is a lot. And like, every week. So every week I'm basically paying fucking like, um, just a lot of gold, bro. It's just every month I'm paying crap. Every. In a full year, the amount of gold I waste on AQ is... I mean, it's not really a waste, because I guess you're doing it. But, like, come on, bro. You gotta give us more fucking gold. This is actually unbelievable how little gold there is in this game. And, um... Or C, make the, um... Like, ways you get gold in this game. Like, arena. Um... What are, I guess, questing crystals. ISO. Um, just make them give you more gold. Because, look. Um... Another thing, also, that's a good point I just thought about is... Four stars, okay, so 
like the rewards back in the day gave you what you needed and okay and it wasn't bottlenecking and the cost of living back then basically was a lot lower than it is now four stars gave you 24 bricks of 5k iso because they don't take that much iso to rank up and yeah whatever but five stars and six stars also give you that much for a dupe when in turn they take a lot more iso and a lot more gold to rank up so it's like they need to also buff like five stars should get double four stars like 48 and six stars should get like what like like i don't know 48 also or like 64 just they need to have more than 24 because when you do a four star and you sell all the iso you get like nothing back and another thing they do that's really stupid i, I really hope i have iso right now okay look take this this is a um 500 brick for some reason in the sell store Every piece of ISO you get is halved for the amount of gold. Like, they literally don't want to give you gold. I don't understand. Like, when a normal 5k brick should give you 5k gold, it only gives you 2.5k instead. Which, to me, is just like, why? I don't understand that concept. There's no there's no point in that except for just screwing over players and giving them less gold. So, in my opinion, they need to just make gold more available. They need to make the stash give a lot. And just be able to hold a lot more because this is just unbelievable. If you've done all the content in the game, you have to watch as your precious revives just get down the drain and even if i did all the paths in abyss okay like most um end game players they, they literally do, they're doing the same thing they're just watching the revives go to waste you know why because there's nothing to do and they're just wasting so much resources and they could either be giving it to someone else that needs it or just having it for future use but nope Bams. like we don't want to let you stash up because when the next hard piece of content comes out we want you to only have 15 revives in your stash so you're going to be forced to spend units it's just unbelievable and this gold shit is unbelievable too the fact that i have to donate my fucking soul to this alliance i've done like 1.2 million gold a fucking month which is like um over like 12 13 14 million in a fucking year which is just just amazing dude just fucking amazing like, I love being in an endgame alliance, but they need to seriously cut the cost of um, map 6 and map 7 because this is unbelievable. Um, if I did, like, all map 6, I think the cost is, like, a 100-something thousand. We had one day of map 7, it goes to a third of a million. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, who is the idea with that? So they need to really lower the cost of AQ. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Comment down below, like, what you think. Like, um, what bottlenecks you, like, a your stage of the game. Like, I, like, I remember for... Um, like when I, when I first started the game, T1 Alpha were like handy, I had like a crap ton, and now when they added 5 stars, the 5 stick a lot more, you have like no T1 Alpha, so you gotta tell me like what you, what you think they could do to fix it and shit like that, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, like, and subscribe, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one, peace.